With Photoshop, there's many different ways of installing gradients, but uh, with Photoshop Elements, and I'm using version 11 here, it's not so particularly obvious. In some ways, it's actually not even particularly obvious where you can actually use the gradients. Um, I've actually got the quick mode, that was the initial startup. So I'm just going to go to the expert mode, click on that. Not that I would classify myself as an expert, but uh, I always go to expert, I don't know, <laughs> quick, quick mode. Anyway, once you've got quick mode, gone from there to expert, you can actually find the gradient in the toolbox. So uh, over there, and you will see this option down here, this option bar. And it will actually have gradient, and you can edit the gradient, you can change the color mode and all those sort of things. And just there, you just see all the selection of current gradients actually installed. Spectrum one, I'm just gonna go sim that's it, simple. Noise samples, and you can see the various ones. Now, if you want to install some new ones, and these the ones I'm actually referring to are from graphicextras.com. There's 32,000 different uh, gradient uh, designs to uh, add. And to add them, you just go to the right side here, and there is a load gradients. Fairly simple, load gradients. And here's lots of the files. I'm just going to go down them. They're all just GRD files. They contain, say, 10, 100, 200 different uh, GRD gradients inside each of the GRD files. And I'm just going to select one of them. That's just one. Click open. Now they've actually been installed, so you can actually use them. So I'm just going to quickly use them. I'm just going to apply gradient here. I'm just going to just drag it across. You see the gradient there. Of course, you can blend it. So I'm just going to use maybe different. I'm just going to go down there. So just apply across. You can create different designs with. Sadly, they haven't actually added any additional sort of gradient uh, types it would be really nice some applications like uh, sumo paint comes to mind that's got a, a quite a large additional set of gradients unfortunately in photoshop and photoshop elements uh, there's only five type of gradients that would be a lovely feature to see added to cc2 cc3 whatever but uh, i'm not holding my breath on that so uh, but i would love to see the gradients to be updated say like the patterns um, editor and the uh, deco scripts. Right, you can of course apply them as radar. I'm just going to go back to normal now. Just apply that. Different things. Right, also you can use them via the layer, new fill layer, gradient. Click OK there. And you will see the gradients appearing in the drop down there. And of course you can also load them at this point as well, load gradients or replace gradients.